my name is Margaret and this is Picture Week on You Volunteer. So I thought I'd talk about a very special picture to me uh, that was taken by my brother, Dave Mansell. Less and less people are shooting on real film these days uh, because we're living in an age where digital cameras have become better and cheaper. So it's very exciting that my brother has gotten into real film photography. Uh, but even more so because he's chosen to get into uh, a very specialized field of photography called large format photography. So normally uh, a 35 millimeter negative is about this big and um, large format photography is special because the negative, not the picture, the negative is about this big. So it's technically 102 by 127 millimeters compared to 35 millimeters. So that's a huge difference. And what ends up happening is that the detail, the level of detail in the photos is much, much deeper and richer than 35 millimeter. So here's the photo uh, that he took of me and I love this photo very much. This was when I had really long hair and my brother wanted to capture it before I cut it all off. So um, you can't see it. Maybe I'll, I'll put up the uh, digital version and I'll, I'll show you how zoomed in you can get on this photo. Here's what his camera looks like. And it's one of the old tiny large cameras and you can see the black plate here and so there it is there's the big back plate so that's why there's a big hood um, because you want to be able to see the view the back plate without any interference from light and you use a little magnifier to look across the back plate like this and you can bend the bellows so that say the top part of the photo is out of focus and then the bottom part is in focus or whatever you really want to do yet. Yeah, it's very, very detailed. Here's the front of the camera. So it has a, a little trigger and it has to be on a very, very sturdy tripod. Here's a photo he took of some friends of his uh, for their band and their cute little doggy. I just love these photos. Here's a couple photos of my brother's friend Sam. Uh, you can really see uh, he's using a lot of natural light in, in these photos. Uh, this photo here, uh, he's taken the time to really set up his studio lights and, and plan it out. Here's a chart of what uh, a couple different cameras can accomplish as far as resolution. So you can see the Nikon D100. D90 and the Canon 5D. Uh, Canon 5D is 4368 by 2912, but a 4x5 would be 11, what, 11,634 by 9126. So that's an amazing, amazing amount of resolution out of this kind of camera. Usually it takes about well, it takes my brother about an hour to set up a, a single shot. So um, he'll measure everything, get all the lighting perfect, and, and then take the shot, and then see what happens. Um, they don't always turn out, but the more you practice, the better you get at setting it up and getting it right the first time. And so he takes these and he uh, has a little dark bag and he, you know, switches them out of the, of the little plate in the dark bag and then takes them and puts them in a chemical bath and develops them his, himself in his kitchen. You can buy developer at camera stores, um, but more and more now you're not going to find um, real film. It's, uh, it's getting more and more expensive, it's becoming a boutique item. And that's really sad because this kind of photography is beautiful and 
very, very difficult, but very, very, very worth it. If you want to learn the true intricacies of photography, it's, it's really an interesting thing to get into. Um, and I'm really happy that my brothers found this awesome hobby and he gets such great shots out of it. And so I'm, I'm just very happy that, uh, that I have this photo of myself. Uh, so that's about it for, for me for picture week. Uh, stay tuned for the rest of the week and uh, we'll see what kind of photos we get out of, uh, out of this week. Alright, see you guys later.